Hello everybody, it's Dave with Lucky 15 Sports Cards, and today I'll be opening slash reviewing 2015-2016 MVP Hockey. Uh, first set in the new season, and uh, today I got nine packs for you guys, so let's take a look at the packs. This is the hobby version. It, you get eight cards per pack, Sidney Crosby in the front, it says find superscript parallels, and let's take a look at the odds in the back. So you want to read all those odds, you can just pause the screen right there. Okay, so... I'll just start opening, look at the cards, tell you what I think of them. So we'll start off with the base. So Drew Doughty, that's the basic base card. I'm not too big of a fan of the gold on a base. I find like upper deck should just stick with their normal silver and like their hits should be like gold. So instead of doing the silver scripts and stuff. Got a checklist of Jonathan Drew. The white's kind of glowing. Oh, it's kind of too dark. Hold on. Okay. Keep going, and we got a rookie silver script. They didn't have these last year, I don't think. Oh, sorry, I gotta focus there. Of Luke Witakowski for the Tampa Bay Lightning. And more base. So I do like the design of that silver script, though. It's just like the base cards, but it says rookie, and it's a silver parallel. So, second pack. And you do get hits per. Uh, in a box. I think it's one per box or something like that. And this one is a silver script of Steve Mason. So that is the regular silver script. Yeah. So third pack. Also heard there was die cut parallels in here. Okay, I can't get this pack open. Ah, uh, come on. There you go. Got it. Okay. And all base in that pack, I think. I know there is short print base cards, but I don't know what the numbering is. I don't know if it's like over 100. It's uh, a short print over 200, so I'm not going to pull those out. And we got a rookie of Stefan Nozen for the Anaheim Ducks. That's cool. That's a very nice design for the rookies. Oh, sweet. These cards look pretty sharp, actually, in person. I don't know if the camera can catch that, but it looks pretty sharp. Claude Giroux, Philadelphia, uh, NHL Territories. I know that they have jersey variations of this card, and those are one in every, like, two boxes, I think. Yeah, normally you, sh you should get... Uh, normally you get 24 packs per box, but I don't really feel like buying a hobby box for this because... You know, like, I'd rather spend it on other stuff than MVP, because MVP's not the the best product to get. But I just wanted to review it for you guys. And we got... No. We got a rookie of Victor Ardividson. I think that I said that right. For the Nashville Predators. Again, very nice rookie design. And we got more base. So we're down to the last four packs. I find Upper Decks, their packs are getting higher quality because before they used to be cheap and shredded. But I think they fixed that. Oh, nice. These are these are sharp looking cards. Okay, as, these are uh, die cut cards. I don't know what they're called, I should say, on the back. This is teal level 3. I think it was color and contours. I'm not sure. But these are sharp looking cards. Just look at all that rainbow stuff. And there's like ice marks on on the card. That's very cool. I always love getting die cuts. Put the base over there. Okay. A few more packs. I might have to get more of this. Uh, it costs $20 for all these nine packs. So it's about $2.25. Oh, sick. Jordan Everly. That will go to the PC. And a silver script of Brayden Holpe. Nice. And the rest is base. Two packs left. Yeah, there is a rare Connor McDavid Rookie Redemption, which would be a beautiful card to get. And that one's all base. Yeah, but so far this product's looking way better than the last year's. And what we got in here? We got a silver script of Kevin Hayes. That's nice. So, uh, after all that, we got this. Big chunk of base cards. 
And then we got uh, three silver, uh, four silver scripts, one of them being a rookie. One color and contours level three uh, teal of Chris Kuditz. We got two regular rookies and one NHL territories. So I think the NHL territories replaced uh, rookie of the month or players of the month from last year. Three stars. Those are kind of boring inserts, but these are nice and nice looking. So I definitely recommend going with hobby, going to the hobby packs instead of buying a blaster. Just buy like as much hobby packs as you can for the same price as the blaster, or just go for a hobby box because that Connor McDavid card's uh, very valuable in the set. So that's it for me today. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to check us out on Facebook, Twitter. Instagram and subscribe here. Click that red button to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you later.